so you can use these examples or links to different library locations and from these locations you can download uh, any any components for your BIM project. Uh, these are most popular at this moment but you can find other locations also. So let's go to uh, BIMobjects.com and in here let's search for external walls for our project. Wall and when I type keyword a uh, program suggests me uh, some other combinations of keywords and I would like to have walls, external walls and from here I can dole out uh, any wall construction uh, but for my project I need a uh, wall uh, construction with some parameters so if I go to my example so I see wall structure example is presented here it has an uh, outside layer of uh, plaster insulation, uh, some glue, uh, some masonry units and internal uh, internal plaster uh, for finishing surface and if I check calculations of this wall so I see the heat transfer coefficient is u equals 0 0.18 so I should look for similar wall or the better insulation performance in the libraries so let's go back to example view and from this uh, library I see some of walls like this one would be great for my project it has some plaster outside, uh, insulation, some glue, and masonry blocks, and inside uh, construction. I can read some specifications from these links or specifications. I don't see information about uh, insulation properties of wall construction, so I will need to download. Uh, I look for international one and download Revit version. Inside Revit I can see these constructions of walls. Of course I don't see any any parameters from here so I need to select wall and press edit type edit type and I need to check uh, what's what are the parameters of these walls. So for me, a, a important part is uh, a heat transfer coefficient, uh, and from here, uh, Revit calculated while uh, looks 0 0.16, uh, 17 maybe, and let's look for the same coefficient which is provided by the manufacturer, and from here. I don't see this coefficient presented here, so let's say for my basic project uh, this information will be enough and uh, I will try to follow uh, for this information. So let's say for my project this wall is... Okay, so I select my wall type which I would like to use in my project. I control copy and go to my project and control V and I insert this wall in my project and other technique how to do it uh, you go to manage transfer project standards and from this uh, wall type uh, or section you uncheck all parameters and you check which parts you would like to import so let's say I would like to have all wall types from this uh, example I press OK, overwrite.
and after transferring you you have all the library of all the wall types uh, in in your project so it's easy for you to just uh, select any wall type from from the library and it's it is much faster to do it uh, copying just one by one it is sometimes simple but sometimes I want to change parameters uh, or select a number so I need to open one more time the same file and copy other wall type so it's better to just uh, transfer all the types and later you can purge 